Okay, in this video I want to take a look at how do I create a two column layout in my main content area. So this is what I want to do. I'm going to click on in here. Uh, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to delete out the font that says um, content for ID bottom, oops, forgive me. I'm going to go into the main and I'm going to uh, delete this out. Content for ID main content goes here. I'm going to hit return, 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 a couple returns. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to build a left column and a right column right in between these two tags because these will be inside of the main content. So here we go. We begin and I'm going to go to my insert window. Now this time I'm going to just insert a div tag. So I'm going to say insert div and what I'm going to say is I'm going to say after start of tag and I want this to be after start of main content. This will be a new CSS rule, and I'm going to name this left column. I'm going to put it on my river.css sheet. I'm going to hit OK, and I'm going to leave this kind of as it is. I can always come back in and change this. My big thing is the size of the box. Now, I'm going to make this box a little bit bigger. I'm going to put the width at um, 650, and I'll put the height, and I kind of forget. Let me come on in. I forget what the height of this one is. I'll put the height in at 500 for now. Again, I can change it. Now, this is where it all works out here. I want to float this left. I'll give it a little bit of a margin. Um, I'll Maybe I'll make it um, same for all, and I'll put it in at 10. And I can undo it, too, because I might want to move it over a little bit more from the top. Maybe I'll do 20 from the top. And I'll hit OK. I'll hit OK, and there's my left column. Now, I'm going to come back into River CSS, and I want to check my main content. My main content, the height is at 900, so probably my left column, I'm going to make it a little bit more like that. Um, my left column, I'm going to put it at 850, the height, 850. Now, um, one thing that I did is I actually didn't put this one. Take a look how left column just has a dot. That's because I put it in as an ID. Um, these other ones, I'm sorry, I put this one in as a class. And these other ones are IDs. So that is the difference. All right, now, it's not a really that big of a deal, so I'm not going to worry about it right now. Now I want to build my right column. And I know that my width is 1,000. And this one is at 650. So I'm going to put this one in at 250. Again, if I want to go in and change it up, I can. So I'm going to come on in here, and I am going to come put my, my uh, cursor after the line of code that's for my left column, and I'm going to insert my right column. Now, I'm going to use a div tag. So I'm going to come to my insert window, and I'm going to choose div. Again, I get my window. I'm going to hit new CSS rule, and I'm going to change this one to an ID. Again, the fact that I did left column, I didn't make it uh, an ID, isn't that, that big of a deal. Now I'm going to put in, I'm going to put in right column. I want to make sure that it's attached to the river CSS. I'm going to hit OK, and I'm going to go to the box. I'm going to put the width in at 250, the height in at 850. This is what I want to make sure I do, is I want to float it right. And I want to, uh, if I give a little margin, I'll do the same for the top. 25 and from the left I'm going to put 10 pixels I'm going to hit OK OK and there it is so what I have right now is I have a left column and I have a right column now as I look at these two as well I don't really like the amount of space that's in between these so I'm going to come on in and I'm going to edit my right column and bring it over a little bit so I can come on in and I can edit it I can come to my properties window, and as long as I see I'm on CSS and I can see right column, I can hit edit rule, and I can move this over a couple different ways. I can go to the box, and I can make it a little bit wider. Maybe I'll put it in at 300, 300, apply. And I could also, I don't like how close it is to the uh, right edge. So I'm going to add a little bit of a margin um, from the right. And I'll put this at 10 and I'll hit apply. So there we have it. We have, and I can put all my content from my left column into this box. 
and my, my content for my right column into this box. Thanks so much.